Yeah, I'm excited to see what this new rule, this new rule is gonna be. One of my favorite uh, athletes, a strong man, he would train by himself in an abandoned stadium. Става Ютуб. Вино сме и днес имаме един много специален гост. И за мен ще е чест да бъде в този клип. Това е първото нещо подобно, което ще видите в България. Часа е 3. Разбрали сме се за 3 часа, но между другото каза, че може да закъсне около 30-40 минути, което е нормално. Аз ще правя крачките малко. Залата е сравнително празна като за 3 след обед. Чакаме го да дойде и човека е... special guest today as I said earlier we're gonna be doing a push session today we have Terence here yo what's up man we have Terence <laughs> this is a huge thing like for the Bulgarian but I to see you just in my video it's gonna be like crazy people love you as I said to you I earlier it. like you have huge fan auditory in Bulgaria it's like crazy man but thank you thank you someday thank you. if you visit you'll see by yourself but <laughs> my father-in-law is Bulgarian but I don't know any your girlfriend is Bulgarian Half. Uh, yeah, yeah. Half yeah, Bulgarian. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, we're, we're doing a his push session today, so I'll be, it would be my pleasure to go through what is he doing. To... It took us like 10 minutes to find a machine, <laughs> but, you know, we're getting started finally. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that one is a little bit better than yeah. the other. So, I get volume um, trainer or low volume. I do low volume, so I probably do two to three sets on most things. Okay, yeah, that's what I do. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I trained with uh, Mike. Mike. Uh, Mike Sommerfeld. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. I just saw him. Uh, was it yesterday? No, two days ago. Yeah, two days ago. Yeah, yeah. So he's a really high volume trainer. Really? Yeah, he he does high volume. He does three. It's Jeremy volume training. Yo, yeah. Ten to ten. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we'll do 15s because I don't see 20s. Oh well, yeah. We're just gonna stack in the 15s. <laughs> gonna stack in the 15s. Let's go. Do you like the bar? Yeah, I mean. I don't think about like moving here, it's like... No, no. It, it, it's good for bodybuilding, you know? Yeah, yeah. And it's really convenient and it's comfortable for me to everything. It's, it's not that, ex it's not expensive to live here either, I find. Like uh, the price is like, I'm probably cheaper than where I live in Tampa. It is, it is cheaper, it is cheaper for I was surprised. I would say it's a lot cheaper than people introduce it to the world. I, I don't think it's yeah. that expensive. Not at all, not at all. It's expensive if you want it to be. Compared to the States, <laughs> The States is stupid right now. <laughs> yeah. And Canada's even worse, like their houses. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, if you to buy a house there is it's dumb. <laughs>
Yeah, I'm excited to see what this new rule, this new rule is gonna be. I hope, I really hope, <laughs> a few pounds more. <laughs> I don't know if they're gonna do a few pounds, but what else can they do? I think, I think it's the height thing, because he commented on the formula. Tries and tries made that post about it, someone was asking about my height, and he commented on it. He said, "Hey, we we're working on something." But I think it's something about the height. If it's height, it's gonna be weight as well. I think we'll see. I personally, I think they're just gonna height us once, either once, Ooh. once, forever, or once a year. I think that might be it, but I don't know. But that would that would be a bad thing because I think too, like maybe changing the height, cause like Breon is five seven and I'm five five, and we have to weigh the same. We have to weigh the same amount of weight. What what is your weight uh, for? You should well, be two hundred. Most of the time it's one eighty. Sometimes it's one seventy five. And you you should be one. I think I should be one eighty. <laughs> of course I'm gonna say the, <laughs> the higher weight. Yeah yeah. Shoulder movements also in triceps. How do you? Normally I do shoulders today and tomorrow I'll do some arms. Okay, yeah, I can hit arms. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Usually I had I had to do legs today, but since I trained full body this week, I had to switch everything up. I think I'm supposed to do legs today too. <laughs> but but uh, my coach was like, oh let's do legs. I did legs on Wednesday Wednesday. Yeah. Uh, so he had me doing like two days early. Yeah. So I was like, all right. <laughs> five five and I'm five. Five seven on a good day. <laughs> so your cutoff was 180? No, no, it's actually 200. Oh, really? Yeah. For five seven? Five seven and three quarters. <laughs> Oh. That's why they measured me in, in uh, California. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Because my back okay. wasn't compressed, you know, when you're staying on your feet all day long and then you go to the weigh-ins, your lower yeah, yeah, yeah. back is compressed. But I was like, for Did they, You know, my least favorite thing about weighing in is when they, they do the weigh-ins like at night. Like, this the Olympia. Like... <laughs> I was like, God damn, bro. The Olympia, they did it at nighttime. Like, yeah, it was did, 9 yeah, p.m., yeah. something like that. I was like, what the fuck, man? And just three microwaves in the whole. Dude, I don't stay there. I don't stay at the host ever um, because that. It's always like that. Like, yeah, it's never, it's always uh, <laughs> like when you go go to where they used to have it just saying it was microwaves every other floor and you had to request a fridge and it would run out so the first night I was like like three four years ago I didn't even have a fridge yeah for my food I had to get like a, 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 a bucket with yeah. some ice yeah yeah they, they never I would never say that. that that disappointed me last year because yeah. I was on floor 19 I believe so up and down up you and down up stayed. and down just... so what I did was there like you know they had that underground thing yeah I stayed at the hotel on the other side oh literally. And they had everything they had a kitchen and everything I just had to walk through the thing to get to the place. I asked one of the judges if I can take the microwave with me. <laughs> Honestly, dude, I remember one year too when Justin Compton was still competing. He just bought a microwave and snuck it in yeah. the room. I mean, it's like 30, 40 yeah. bucks. Yeah, and just left it there. Yeah, just leave it there. <laughs> I'll just leave it there. Yeah, yeah. And just put another. I saw what you guys did in the desert. It was nice. I bet oh, it was hot. Oh, <laughs> it was actually okay. Really? It was okay ish, yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, y'all did a tour. Yeah, we, we went to a tour. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you guys um, just drove out there. You need the SUV to go deep in the dunes. And that's where we wanted to film it, but yeah. Okay, okay. We filmed it two, two times, so the first time we didn't catch the, the background, the sunset or whatever properly, so I was dead by pausing the first time in the desert. Like, it was <laughs> 40, 40 degrees and I was dead, and he's like, okay, we're gonna redo it. And I'm like, oh, come on, do it again. <laughs> yeah. I 
like, no. Florida, we all started in Fort Long Beach, Florida. Okay. Yeah, yeah, he did his first show. I remember when I, I think he started maybe two, three years before I did. Because by the time I started. When did you start? Like 20? My first show was in 2013. By that time, he had already competed and left the area. So I'm thinking maybe 2010-ish. Okay. So he's been competing for a long time. So I've cool. been competing 10 years. So I'm guessing him like maybe 15, 15 years maybe. I'm competing for eight, eight years now. Long time. So 16. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, I remember I started, his, uh, this guy, he used to sponsor me. He owned a supplement company. He's like, oh, the first time he showed up, he said he's not gonna do any any of his dad poses that don't even bring it up. And the first pose that hits on stage is the victory pose. And I was like, ah. Oh. <laughs> like, yeah, okay. the victory pose is like. <laughs> Man. Maybe right, right here. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I've never seen such machine, never in my life. It's a, like, I want to boost my dopamine, like, naturally. Yeah, yeah. And just by lifting weights, mm -hmm. not by listening to music. Yes, because the music is going to give me extra dopamine, I'm going to feel good, but I don't want it that way. I want to, like, uh, be more, like, in the thing. One of my favorite um, athletes is, uh, is, is, I forget his full name, but they call him Big Z. He's um, a strong man. He would train by himself in an abandoned stadium, and he won like dozens and dozens of championships. Like no music, no training yeah. partner, no other people, just him and the weight. Yeah, and his team. <laughs> He's cool, dude. He's a cool. You gotta watch him, dude. I love strong man. Zivukovic? I can't. I can't remember. Oh. Eastern European. Eastern European. Eastern European. Eastern European. He's a cool yeah. dude. Um, he's like one of the oldest guys, and. Um, He's even like a mayor in his town. He's like, he's like strong man, couple hours a day. I need something else, you know? So he's just the mayor. And uh, he's got a whole room full of his trophies. He's just a, he's just a badass. I have, to get, I have to see you the name later when I can think of it. <laughs> up today it was a great boost session with Ruff thanks for having me man like yeah, it was amazing fun. it was fucking amazing and <laughs> I, I I enjoyed it because we like just playing around I was following his stuff yo it was a lot of fun and it's like the same way that I train it's like I, I really enjoyed it and we did some posing did some posing we had uh, Mike hop in too oh, yeah, so yeah, a little yeah. preview for the old going down so <laughs> you know check this video out if you if you need some old content and um the yeah. socials here so you're gonna see you know already who he is but still his <laughs> socials are here <laughs> and yeah he's one of the best come on we can't we can't say nothing less than that thank you thank, thank you. you guys for watching see ya Peace.